I got diagnosed with MS at the age of 37. I've come from Australia to come to um, India to get treatment. The reason I came to India is because Australia didn't um, have the right facilities to give me the um, treatment that I needed. I suffered a lot for three and a half years. I wasn't able to walk around, um, do things with my daughter. I wasn't able to play. Um, the focus became chronic pain, fatigue. I was in bed and it became unbearable. Now I went through a lot of loops in Australia to try and get the treatment, but unfortunately they were unable to give me the treatment. So over the time, um, I'd looked into, we have a person that had the treatment in Australia and her name was Carmel Turner, and she had got hold of Dr. Amit um, from India and said, that this is the way to go and um, my, I was living a ticking time bomb. I didn't want to have to live that life anymore. I wanted to be able to drive my child to school, I wanted to be able to make her lunch, I didn't want to be bedridden all the time and chronic, the pain was just debilitating. I'd lose the full left side of my body, I'd lose my speech, I'd lost my eyesight. So I was on a ticking time bomb, so I needed to get my um, information to Dr. Amit as soon as I found out that he was doing the protocol that I needed for the treatment, I um, sent the information to him. I'm a bit emotional. I find it very emotional to talk about. Um, so we sent the information off to Dr. Amit and within three weeks I got the yes. So within another three weeks we were on the aircraft to come here so um, to have the treatment, which I've been... Words just can't exp express how grateful I am to have a new, new lease in life. To come to India and find that everyone is just, they're people people. Australia isn't people people. It's, it's, it's about politics and money and all of the rest of it. And you get into India and it's just all about how we can help you and stay positive and pray for you and just be there for you. Dr. Amit has got it like no room for error at all. So I have, I tell everyone just leave your body in the hands of Manipal Hospital and let them do their magic. So I recommend anyone worldwide, which is worldwide, will be coming to Manipal Hospital to have this treatment because it's so um, accessible and it should be like this everywhere. I pinch myself every day, I can't believe that I'm here and alive and well and healthy and I've got a big smile on my face. I also wish to say that um, since I've had the treatment, um, with MS comes a horrible fog. You, your brain is, for everybody it's an individual disease, so for myself it affected my cognitive and um, like my memory and everything was a fog, a haze and I'd have like, I couldn't concentrate on a conversation with one on one with a person. So um, just when I came out of after having the stem cell re-put into my body and coming out of the BMT room every day, the cloud has lifted. I cannot express that enough that I'm able to sit here and have a one on one conversation whereas previously I'd I'd have heaps of things going on in my head. So the clarity has just changed so much and I've got no pain, no pain at all, which is just phenomenal. So every day I'm getting up without getting out of bed feeling like I'm a 92 year old, I'm actually feeling my age of a 38 year old. I'm able to just get up and do what I need to do. I just cannot, words just can't describe how much I appreciate it. So um, we, um, I found the protocol and the whole, uh, the whole um, treatment itself very good. All in all, I, I just I couldn't floor the system. They just looked after me and have made me such a happy, wonderful woman today. And I'm going to get to get home and see my daughter. So it's it's emotional.